Tim Matheson's new memoir, Damn Glad to Meet You, reveals raunchy Hollywood tales, including three women in one day. In his candid new memoir, Damn Glad to Meet You, Tim Matheson, the iconic star of Animal House, opens up about his wild escapades in Hollywood, including a particularly outrageous birthday celebration that involved separate encounters with three women in a single day. At 76, the actor reflects on his colorful past with a mix of humor and self-awareness, sharing stories that capture the hedonistic spirit of the entertainment industry in the 1970s and beyond. Matheson recalls the events leading up to his 33rd birthday, a day marked by a string of intimate encounters while his then-girlfriend worked in New York. The festivities began when a close female friend, described as wearing a cherry lace top and crotchless velvet panties, unexpectedly knocked on his door, eager to surprise him with an early birthday gift. Matheson's playful recollection of this encounter sets the tone for the memoir, where he embraces his past with a blend of nostalgia and candidness. Despite the fun he was having, Matheson insists in the book that he genuinely loved his girlfriend, who was 3,000 plus miles away. However, he doesn't shy away from admitting, it doesn't mean I wasn't a pig and an idiot, showcasing his ability to reflect on his younger self with a critical eye. Later that same day, the actor received another knock at his door from a beautiful waitress he was familiar with, leading to yet another rendezvous. But the most memorable encounter of the day was with none other than Kirstie Alley, who was on the cusp of her rise to fame. At the time, Ali was still two years away from starring in Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan, and five years from her breakout role in the sitcom Cheers. In a candid account, Matheson describes how Ali called him up and asked to come over. He reminisces about their time together, writing, Kirsty hadn't hit yet. She was also a few years from Scientology and, so, still in her fun Wichita gal now in LA partying phase. Their post coital conversation took an unexpected turn when Matheson heard a noise downstairs his girlfriend had flown in to surprise him for his birthday. In a moment of quick thinking, Matheson managed to divert his girlfriend's attention, buying just enough time for Ali to make a discreet exit. This anecdote is just one of many that highlight Matheson's ability to navigate the chaotic waters of Hollywood romance, showcasing both his charm and the unpredictable nature of his lifestyle. Beyond his romantic escapades, Matheson's memoir also touches on his relationships with notable figures in the entertainment world, including iconic supermodel Twiggy, who had her sights set on settling down. He also recounts a startling encounter with Georgianne, a woman whose sister turned out to be none other than Cher. It was startling to say the least, Matheson recalls, humorously reflecting on the surprises that come with dating in Hollywood. Through, Damn Glad to Meet You, Matheson offers readers a glimpse into his life, from his breakout role as Eric, Otter, Stratton in, Animal House, to his later performances in, Fletch, and, Heart of Dixie. He candidly discusses the ups and downs of his career, including missed opportunities like turning down the iconic role of Mac Jiver and the father character in, Seventh Heaven. As Matheson shares these raunchy tales from his past, he does so with a sense of gratitude and amusement, reminding readers of the unpredictable nature of fame and the colorful characters that populate the world of Hollywood. Damn Glad to Meet You serves not only as a memoir of his life and career but also as a testament to the lessons learned along the way, making it a must-read for fans of classic cinema and anyone curious about the realities of life in the limelight. With his trademark humor and honesty, Matheson invites readers to join him on a journey through his memorable and often outrageous experiences in the entertainment industry.